हेलो स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ क्लास नाइन वेलकम टू योर बायो क्लास स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट सेक्सुअली ट्रांसमिटेड डिजीजेस डिजीजेस लाइक सिफिलिस गोनोरिया एंड एड्स आर एग्जांपल्स ऑफ सेक्सुअली ट्रांसमिटेड डिजीजेस सेक्सुअली ट्रांसमिटेड डिजीजेस आर दोज डिजीजेस विच आर स्प्रेड थ्रू सेक्सुअल कॉन्टैक्ट सिफिलिस इज काउज बाय बैक्टीरिया ट्रीपोनीमा पैलेडम एंड सिम्टम्स ऑफ सिफिलिस इंक्लूड पेनलेस सोर रैशेस ऑन जेनिटल एरियाज लिप्स एट्सेट्रा गोनोरिया इज अनदर एग्जाम्पल ऑफ कॉमन सेक्सुअली ट्रांसमिटेड डिजीज इट इज काउज बाय बैक्टीरिया निसेरिया गोनोरोई एंड सिम्टम्स इंक्लूड पेनफुल यूरिनेशन एबडोमिनल पेन एट्सेट्रा next common sexually transmitted disease is aids aids stand for acquired immunodeficiency syndrome it is one of the most dreadful diseases nowadays it was first detected in usa in 1981 students it is estimated that there are approximately 38 million people with aids across the globe aids is caused by a virus called as hiv hiv stands for human immunodeficiency virus children hiv is that type of virus which infects human immune cells and destroys the immune system of the body actually they attack white blood corpuscles t4 lymphocytes and makes the person susceptible to a variety of diseases hiv typically spreads from one person to another person through sexual intercourse apart from it the other ways of its transmission are contaminated blood transfusion use of contaminated needles and syringes organ transplantation from an infected person's body to the healthy person's body it can also be transmitted from an infected mother to her child during pregnancy period or through breast feeding students you must know that hiv does not spread by mere physical touch sharing food mosquito bites shaking hands hugging sharing toilet seats etc various stages of hiv infection includes asymptomatic stage which persists for first to 6 weeks of infection here patient develops flu like symptoms but can infect others mild symptomatic stage may continue up to 10 years at this stage antibodies can be detected in the blood major symptomatic stage results in uh, severely damage to the immune system and the condition now has progressed from hiv disease to aids patient becomes prone to a variety of diseases general symptoms of aids include persistent fever fatigue weight loss diarrhea pneumonia fungal infections development of different types of tumors etc we all know that prevention is always better than cure so let's see preventive measures first is avoid multiple partners 
Second, there should be use of disposable needles and syringes. It can also be prevented through the protected uh, sexual contact. Another very important fact which can be taken into account to prevent the spread of HIV is to create awareness among the people. Common tests to detect HIV are antigen antibody test which looks both for antibodies made against HIV in the blood and for the virus directly. Next is ELISA test. ELISA stands for enzyme linked immunosorbent assay. This test detects presence of antigen in the body of patient. Other type of test which is used for detection is western blot test. An AIDS patient dies from those infections which a healthy immune system would typically be able to fend off. So the treatment or therapy of AIDS patients should include such methods which would enhance the strength of immunity system. Art therapy is one of them. AIDS patient can be given art therapy. Art stands for antiretroviral. So the therapy is called as antiretroviral therapy. It involves a combination of medicines. This therapy slows down HIV replication which gives immune system a chance to recover and helps fight off other infections more effectively.